Hey, it's Martin here and today I wanted to record a short video about car insurances in Ireland. So guys, if you live in Ireland, uh, you probably heard that it's, I mean, it's all over the Facebook, all over the internet. Um, I think it started maybe around four years ago um, when the car insurances went went up and it, it wasn't like 20% up, it was like 100, 200 or even 500% up. So, I mean, I've got a lot of friends who are complaining about this issue and I've read a lot of stories on the internet, but I didn't have that problem, so I guess I wasn't paying much attention to that. Until, until I got a second car. So I bought another car and I called my current insurance company and they said the car is too old. Well, I've heard that stories before that if it's over 15 years old, um, it might be tricky to, to insure your car. So I've called another one and they were fine with the age of the car. But um, well, the problem is I didn't have any claims for the past 10 years. I mean, I never had a claim. So your experience and your no claim bonus discount has the most, the, the, the most impact on your policy. And I've called many companies here in Ireland and many brokers. So pretty much I've spoken with everyone. And the problem is if you want to insure your second car, you need to start from scratch. It's like, uh, it's like, so, so basically what, what they're saying is they ask you if you've got any experience, they ask if you've got no claim bonus discount, which I do obviously 10 years now, but they say that I use my experience and no claim bonus discount on my first car. So, so I can't use it on my second car. So I've earned some experience and some no claim bonus discounts, but I can't use it with my second car. So, so what they say, so what they saying is like the experience and the no claim bonus discount belongs to a car. You cannot use it on your second car. So the car companies will treat you like a, like a person who, ju who just starting, who has no experience in driving, no discounts whatsoever. And well, you're just starting from scratch, like you're a new guy. And it's ridiculous, isn't it? I mean, I guess that's, the, that's their way to get your money from your pockets. So um, I've recorded most of the phone calls here. So I'm gonna show you in a second how stupid that is on my computer. Actually, I'm gonna go over to some car insurance company and I'm gonna fill in the form and I'm gonna show you what's the difference between and, and how do they ask you about your experience and no claim bonus and how does it affect my, my premium premiums here. So. So guys, as you see, this figure pops up when I play by the rules and put zero experience and zero no claim bonus discount as they want me to. So basically another car for me is for grant um, and it's an old car. And this is only basic insurance, third party fire and theft, that's it. So if you're gonna switch to comprehensive, it's four and a half grand. Now let's see what I put to get this figure. Like you see here, it asks me how many years have you been driving claims free within Ireland? And the honest answer would be 10, 10 years. I've, I have 10 years of experience here. But they want me to put zero, okay? Because that's a second car. So they say that my experience is going to stay with my first car. Now, when I switch it to six years plus, you see here, it's four times cheaper. So with six years of experience, you're gonna get this figure here. And I guess that's fair enough. So even though they are asking you how many years have you been driving claims free within Ireland or the UK, you need to lie here and say zero if it's your second car. You need to lie here, because basically if you're gonna say true, uh, they won't accept the form. So that's the reality here in Ireland. Welcome to the AA. to insure a, a car which you bought my first question would be do you do any deals with any company any insurance company that could do a mirror for me on no claim bonus yes so this is a second car is it exactly no <laughs> no if you're if you're if you get a second car uh -huh. you need to get a second no claim bonus which means you need to start again I'm I'm a hundred percent sure that my friend has mirroring in now as we speak. Uh, when? How long has your friend been with? Two years. 
that could be why because it's uh, two years ago like in here we actually would have done it two years ago with AXA oh. but we don't do it anymore so is there any company in Ireland that could do mirroring for me or it's no. pointless to even look for for one I haven't heard of any usually if it's the second car the second no claims bonus wow okay so I need to start over from scratch yeah yeah. So the bottom line is if you're gonna get a second car you need to start from scratch and even though you're paying like 500 euro for the first car you need to start from few thousand on your second car even though you've got the same experience and the same no claim bonus but they won't allow you to, to, to mirror that. So like you saw here the difference is pretty much huge because if they will allow me to mirror my discounts I would I would pay a grand for another car but um, but now it says like in the quotation it says 4000 euro so so you can't do pretty much nothing with that. Like I said, I've spoken with uh, many reps from different companies and they all said the same thing. Now, there's not even one company in Ireland that could mirror your discounts and you need to start from scratch. So that's good. So guys, I made this video hoping it will reach to, to someone who can actually do something with this, to, to a lawyer, solicitor or whatever. So guys, please share this video to your friends and maybe as a group we've got higher chance to actually do something with that. Um, please let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below and thanks for watching. See ya!